everybody in here, sitting here in the tiny house, having my coffee. I've got my new phone and I'm trying to learn how to use it. And I got to tell you, the screen is a lot better. It's like way more HD. I'm looking at myself. I mean, I can see every single flaw on my face. I remember, I remember saying that when I got the, the other phone that I had. That phone, the glass on it must not have been very good glass because I even had a screen protector over it. And within a month or two, it started cracking. Um, and I've always been very, very careful with it, um, not dropping it and that sort of thing. Um, and I think, I think what I did, though, is I didn't get a good enough case on it. Um, I got like a very low profile one. It wasn't very heavy duty. So I've ordered a screen for this one, and it's got a bigger screen, um, and it's not going to be coming till the end of the week, so I'm just going to have to be really, really careful with this phone until then. Um, so I've been playing around with it, trying to learn how to use it. It's different. Um, it is an ex inexpensive phone. I use Cricut for my wireless, and the phone that I got is their brand. It's uh, called an Ovation. And um, it was like only $79, but it has better cameras. It has a better screen. Um, it seems faster. And uh, I just, I like it. I like it. So I wasn't going to spend a whole lot of money on it. But um, yeah, so I like it anyhow. Um, I went to the post office and there were a ton of packages. Now I have to tell you, I've been ordering things myself and I had some things delivered too via UPS. Um, so I've been ordering some things for myself and I don't want to feature those in a video because I mean, they're not prezzies. They're just things that I bought for myself that I needed. So I've actually opened all of these already. So you don't get to see me do that. <laughs> um, so I'm going to just get them all over here and show you one by one what they are because some really awesome people sent me some great things. <laughs> Okay, so let's get going. All right, these first, I don't know, maybe three? I, I think they're all from Donna. Let me just make sure. Um, I'm going to get them all out and get the notes. Miss Donna B. And she's thinking of me getting bored up in here. And uh, when it gets really cold outside like today, it's freezing. That's why I got my hat on and my hoodie. I got the heat on and everything. But anyhow, let's get to it four videos. First one is, oh, and I've, I've not seen any of these movies, so, and I gotta remember to keep looking over there. Uh, this one has Antonio Bandera. Bandera, yeah. Banderas in it, Black Butterfly, so I'm gonna enjoy watching that. I just used my laptop. It's got a DVD player. This next one is, oh, yes. I don't know how to say this, but Conature. Conature? <laughs> this um, uh, the guy who wrote the book, uh, Louis L'Amour, I love his story. So this is gonna, and I love Sam Elliott too. Oh, I've had a big crush on him forever. Next one is Red Wing. Um, I don't even know what this is, but oh, it's got some good people in it and it's, it's gonna be lovely. Uh, let's see. I'll see you in my dreams. I've never seen this either. So I'm gonna watch all of these and I'm going to love them. Thank you so much, Donna. You are a sweetheart. Okay, this next one. <laughs> I actually kind of cried a little bit when I opened it because it was just so thoughtful. It's from Teresa. She's been sick. She's out of the hospital now. But she sent me an LED light, and it is a therapy lamp. I haven't opened it yet. I haven't tried it. And it gives you the kind of brightness and whatnot to make you not feel so sad when it's dark and gloomy outside. So this was really very meaningful to me. Thank you so much, Teresa. I'm going to give this out a try today. Okay, next. Now, all I did with this one is open up the box. So I don't know what all is in here. Uh, there's a card in it, and it's a beautiful Christmas card. Beautiful. And, dear girlfriend, Merry Christmas and all Happy New Year's to you and the homestead. It's not much, but I feel, but um, I think you will love them. It's okay. 
to say my name also Lori Cross oh my gosh this is a pretty card and a very nice message so let's see here we go I'm gonna open it up it's got some packing peanuts in it oh my goodness okay first of all I'm gonna see if I can just pull this out a chicken napkin holder look at that and she got me some pretty napkins to go in it too this is great um because I've, I actually save napkins when I go out to eat. If I ever go like McDonald's, I went to McDonald's yesterday and uh, I regret it. I really do. But I had been wanting a quarter pounder with cheese for so long. So I went ahead and got one. Um, look at that. So I saved the extra napkins. So I'm just going to put them in there. <laughs> this is great. And she also sent me wide egg noodles egg noodle product i'm so glad you sent these to me because i am out of egg noodles and i love to put them in like um you know beef stew and stuff and just to kind of get it a little bit more um so these are going to be great thank you oops i'm getting packing peanuts all over the place a chicken basket oh i could even gather eggs in this i've got the the egg gatherer for um that I got from Lena. So you know what? I may gather my eggs in this and take that other one that Lena gave me over to Mr. Lucas because I don't think he has an egg basket. But look at how pretty that is, you guys. Oh, thank you so much, Lori. I absolutely love it. And it kind of goes with the basket the decor that I got going on inside this tiny house. Okay, I'm gonna, I have to stop this for just a minute. I gotta pick up this stuff. Hang on. Look at Judy. She's being calm for once. Okay, this next one is from Ruthie J. Um, enjoy your gift. I remember that you like this, and I do, do like this very much. So check this out. Oh, and I'm almost out of this stuff, too. I got some more B&M. Oh, brown bread, the original. Oh, thank you so much. I still have a few cans of the raisin one left. But um, I think I'm completely out of the original, so thank you so much. This stuff lasts forever on the shelf. Well, I mean, it doesn't last forever because I eat a lot of it, and I love to put cream cheese on it. So I, I need to get some more cream cheese, so thank you, Ruthie. I love this stuff. Okay, um, let me set this over here. Oh, that's heavy. All right, I have two more boxes, and they are from the same person, um, Marietta. These, she actually ordered them from, I have like an Amazon affiliate storefront and I have things listed on it that um, would be good for like off grid, shelf stable type stuff. It's food items. She went to that list and just got me a bunch of stuff. So let me show it to you. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. This is so very thoughtful and all the things on that list it's in my pantry storefront um i've either bought before or have been bought for me and i absolutely just oops that's weird the light is going up and down anyhow um i love all the stuff so here let me just let me just show you i need to quit blabbing dole cherry mixed fruit somebody had sent these to me before and i absolutely love them they are good for just like a quick energy boost somebody had bought me these before so i went ahead and added them to that uh that pantry store um it's i mean the storefront isn't a wish list or anything it's just products that i bought or have been bought for me that i really like i earn a little bit of money every time somebody buys something off this off the either of those lists there's recommended for off-grid rv life that's one list and then there's the pantry one and this is great okay one thing uh oh look at this now this is not on my list i'm gonna add it so she must have just found this on her own a big can of chicken this is great I think I might even go ahead and use this today because I want to make a big pot of something it's it's a good day for a big pot of soup or stew or something like that okay and look at this okay 
This is blueberry muffin mix. And uh, let me see if I can just open this real quick. Um, it is the kind that you just add water or milk. See that? Blueberry muffins. I've made these before in my little Coleman camp oven, and they're great. I can also use this in my little cornbread maker, that little old-fashioned, you know, one that closes and whatnot. I've made uh, this in that as well. And there are nine, I think there are, yep, nine packs of these. Nine packs of these. So I'm going to be hooked up for some baked goods. And then, lasagna. Lasagna noodles, and I'm actually out of lasagna, so I'm going to have some lasagna very soon. Um, okay, that's one big box. Next. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, this is heavy. This is heavy. Okay. She got me some extra virgin olive oil, and this is the kind of oil I like to use to cook. Well, oh, looks like somebody's coming. Hang on. Somebody did come. It was uh, FedEx, the FedEx driver. And this little girl, man, she gets in her big old transit van and she just backs raw all the way up that drive. Yes, FedEx is, is welcome. Uh, all right, Judy, please don't knock over this camera. Um, they delivered my carpet that I ordered. And I'll show that to you in another video. It's nothing spectacular. It's big. <laughs> so that's going to, oh God, that's going to be so wonderful once I can get down on the floor. So let me finish. Okay. Olive oil. Cocoa. Nestle's Toll House Cocoa. I love to put a scoop of this in my coffee with a little bit of sweetener. Shake it up and it's so delicious. And milk. She got me shelf stable milk. This is fantastic. I love it. And I can make hot cocoa with it. Okay. <laughs> she got me four cans of mixed vegetables. And you know that I needed the mixed vegetables so I can make a proper chicken pot pie. I have some pie crusts out in the freezer. Well, refrigerator. Well, it's probably a freezer right now. Um, so she got me four cans of those. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Great, now I don't have to go to the store for a while. Um, and last but not least, these are Hormel microwave meals, but I don't have a microwave. Um, and I actually ate one of these last night. Let me show them to you. They are these completes. Normally, you just stick them in the microwave for about a minute or something. All I do is I take it out of the wrapping, I leave this little cover on, and I put them in a big pot that has two tuna cans turned upside down, put a little bit of water in it, and then I put this on top so this is the bottom doesn't touch the hot, you know, bottom, and just uh, bring the water to a boil, let it boil for about five minutes, and I have a ready-made meal. This is one of my favorite flavors of it and so this is awesome it hit the spot last night it really did um, I was hungry I didn't feel like you know making anything so I had one of these and it's delicious so that all comes from Marietta and we've been talking back and forth you and I Marietta and you seem to think there might be one more package I don't know I think this is all of it let me know if I should be expecting something else Thank you so much. It's so thoughtful. I can't believe it. And it was so thoughtful to go to that storefront and pick me out those things that you know I like. And I think I'll have to check. I'll have to double check. I think I get a little commission off it. I'm not positive. So um, we'll have to wait and see. Anyhow, uh, okay, so this this has all been long enough. Um uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to add anything else to this video just because I'm still learning my phone and it's just confusing to me. Um, I haven't even gone out and checked the chickens yet. It's sunny outside and it's finally starting to warm up. In fact, I'm going to go turn the heat off right now because it is starting to get warm in here. Um, everything is going good with the two dogs together. Papa just sticks by me. He does. And if he starts going too far, I just holler at him and, and he comes running right back. So anyhow that's all I got for you guys today see you in the next video
for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.